How can I create a visualization and connect it to the variables in my project? Here I've got a very simple project. I've got an RS ledge with variables already attached to it. I've got a set variable, a reset variable, and a lamp which is connected to the output. To create a visualization, we just do a right click on the application and select visualization. Now we can select the name. It will now create a visualization a task for the visualization and a visualization manager so we can already start using the visualization. Here we can go to the right and take a look at the toolbox. This will offer you different elements which you can use in your visualization to display your real process. We'll just go to common controls, select a button to turn on the lamp, a second button to turn off the lamp, and then a lamp to display the output of the RS knowledge. So if we just align them, we can now select a button and go to the properties. Here we can set a text, so for example on, and connect it to the variable. So we go to input configuration and then tap and select the variable here by using the three dots. Go into our application, PLC PRG, and then select X Viso set. We do the same for the second button. So this time we'll say off and again select the variable. Now we can select the lamp and here it looks a little bit different since it's a different element but also we have a variable which we can attach to this object. So we select X Viso lamp. Now if we connect to our controller, we can already start using the visualization in the cockpit. Now if we ask if we want to proceed with the download. If we press the button on, the lamp turns on and if we press the button off, the lamp turns off. If we now put this side by side, we can see that if I hold this button, the variable is true. And if I let it go, it will be false again. Same for the second button here. Now we want to take a look at the visualization in the browser. To open the visualization in the browser, you just type in the IP address slash webvisu. If you get the error 503 service not available, most likely your web server on the controller is not running. To activate it, we just go to the web based management by typing in the IP address slash WBM. And then we go to Ports and Services, PLC Runtime Services. Here we quickly log in. Standard password is Vago. And then we can check if the web server is enabled. Here we can see it is not, so I will select Web Server Enabled and Submit it. Now we can refresh the page and take a look at the visualization. The elements are very big since the visualization is currently set to anisotropic scaling. I will go more into detail on the scaling options in a future video. I just want to demonstrate that if I hit on, the lamp turns on, and if I hit off, the lamp turns off again.